Oh man, did you like that song? Oh, you you probably did. couldn't hear it very well on on your end. I, I, I could make it off here quite decently. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, right on. Yeah, I got this set up way better. There's no noise. I like it. I'm hoping that the sound is crystal clear tonight. I think it's probably the best sound I've ever had. Hopefully, I shouldn't say that. Knock on wood. Um, <laughs> yeah, but... Um, okay, now, you said you had a friend... Uh, that you went to high school with that told you some really inside information about um, something like real life X Men. Oh yes, yeah, and uh, and uh, you know, the the X Men was was more of an analogy. Uh, the individuals I speak of are actually kind of like you, you and me. Uh, they aren't a very well-known community of people quite yet, but and unlike the X-Men, they don't possess uh, the overpowered uh, abilities like flight or laser eye blasting uh, kind of powers. Um, they 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 do have, however, have abilities like uh, sliding chairs with uh, with uh, telekinesis or. Uh, yeah, and, uh, th- though granted to to achieve uh, that that kind of a feat, uh, it it takes uh, those people years to train. Uh, th- th- there's a th- there's actually an, a, a, an awesome website uh, where uh, where everyone that, that's listening can actually go to and and actually t- t- test the, the my, my claims uh, out for themselves. Now this I gotta write down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I sometimes write things down the old school way. Okay, hit me, hit me with, hit me with it. All right, it is. Look through my notes here. Uh, here it is. It, it, the website is the is uh, http colon forward slash forward slash. Uh, uh, community dot nation dot com. Is it uh, community dot Sion nation? It's it's spelled a p s i o n n a t i o n dot com. P s i o n. That's right. Yeah. Nation. P s i. So there'd be two n's or Sio nation. Yeah. It's uh, two ends. Okay, Scion Nation. Yep. And that's all one word. It's uh, all lower ca- all lower uh, letters. Yeah, it, yeah, it's it's, it's all, uh, all lower ca- all lower, lower case letters. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna try that out, and then I'll put a link on uh, hashtag forty seven talk. Uh, probably be tomorrow because I got to work tonight. Um, that's why I gotta finish early in about 10 minutes we're gonna have to finish this show but we'll be back on tomorrow night hopefully Adam will come back on with us it's gonna be uh, well it's not as late for you uh, we'll be starting at your on your time around one o'clock um, yep. and uh, hopefully you come back on with us and um, oh this so w- what can you do on this website well, yeah, yeah, on on the website, uh, if, if once you if, if you join up, uh, or even if you don't join up, uh, you, you can uh, look at uh, uh, a huge amount of, of uh, articles and guides uh, for, from from uh, from the, the, the this community called uh, uh, Scions, and uh, so that's what they're called. They're not, not they're not uh, they're not the the X Men or the the Scions. And um, on, on the website, you can learn uh, 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 telekinesis, telepathy, uh, a lot of different kinds of, of projection abilities, uh, and, uh, and another ability called energy manipulation, which, which is quite an interesting uh, uh, kind of uh, an ability. And... Um, 
Is that is that like a fire starter kind of thing where you can like uh, make somebody's head explode or catch on fire buildings and stuff like that? I uh, no uh, th- that that would be uh, that would be m- m- more like uh, uh, pyrokinesis. E- energy manipulation is is where you uh, uh, essentially you're, you're, you're using a psionic energy, like a, a psychic energy, and, and and shaping it into objects, and and programming them to do anything. <laughs> There's actually been been, been uh, a few, uh, quite a few science from my generation who who have actually made uh, Pokemon constructs. Uh, you're telling me that they made real life Pokemons? No. Yeah, it's yeah, it's kind of a, a weird thing, but it's, but it's it's uh, the energy versions of them. It's so, kind of kind of wild. Maybe that's where the chubacabra comes from. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> you think? Potentially, yeah. They've been around for quite a while. Wow. And 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 uh, yeah. where did they get the idea for from watching the movie Carrie? From Carrie. Uh, the uh, the. Uh, the the uh, idea of uh, of uh, manipulating uh, thermal energy I think that was uh, actually that was quite ancient actually yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, the, the, so as it's uh, I gotta tell you one time when I was on magic mushrooms I was walking across this carpet that's static electricity right carpet. And we always knew that we'd rub our feet on it, but this time I could feel the static electricity going in my body, and I was able to sit oh, down in a chair and just suck static electricity out of the air, and I just charged myself up to the point where I could almost felt like I was going to burst, and then I and then I let it go and zapped I zapped stuff, and I, I electricity bolts came right out of my hand, and, and just like the Dark Lord from Star Wars, I'm not kidding. Wow. Then you're definitely a candidate for being a scion, then. <laughs> yeah. If you wish. I sent my brother flying across the room. I didn't know what I was doing. The first blast sent him about six feet through the air and hit the couch. Lucky there was a couch behind him. Uh, he screamed yeah. at me and said, don't you ever do that again. <laughs> <laughs> he, he said, you almost killed me, man. Um, and then... Uh, we, we thought we were just hallucinating, so I zapped this radio that was on my grandmother's freezer, and uh, it fried all the wiring, and all the wiring was melted all the way back to the fuse box the next morning, <laughs> wow. so we knew it was real. Yeah. And she had to get, an, my grandmother had to get an electrician in there to fix everything. So. <laughs> wow. So, w- what other, um, wow. So, oh, still interested in where did they who who started this whole thing and is it an ancient uh, group that uh, is this uh, like Atlantean knowledge possibly that they're tapping into uh, uh, well it's do you have any idea uh, well, the, well the, 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 the the knowledge in, in general actually comes from the uh, middle ages if I'm, if I'm correct uh, it, it's uh a lot of it actually comes from from uh, either uh, mi- mi- middle age uh, uh, the, the psychics from that era, and and and, uh, and that mixed with uh, our, our current uh, scientific and not knowledge and progresses uh, and uh, pr- progresses uh, uh, the the two kind of came together for uh, the. Psionic knowledge of, of now. You know, come to think of it, I, I've I've heard that word before, but I don't know where I've heard it. The psionic. Um, I'm not sure what where I've heard that. It yeah. may be from a comic book, possibly, but I've heard that before. Psionic. Yeah. It's not really psychic. It's a little different than psychic, right? 
Yeah, it's it's a it's a bit different from from psychic, but yeah. yeah. So what abilities did your friend actually have? Yeah, he 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 had uh, telekinesis. Wow. It was actually. You seen him do the, it? I did actually. He, he, he it's kind of funny. He, he, uh, one one time in in uh, the in uh, high school, he, he he came up to me and uh, during kind of a, a, a break session we had there, uh, he, he came up to me and 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 he yeah he asked me, uh, hey bro, do you want to see some real telekinesis? And and uh, and so. And so I, I, I kind of decided to give him the, the the benefit of the doubt, and and and, uh, and so I, I said, sure, and and so there were, there we were we were sitting uh, across from another on on this table, and and he, and he takes out this uh, uh, this really simple kind of pinwheel. And 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 they and 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 they uh, uh, tack that 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 was uh, that had uh, oh, two inches uh, about two inch long needle in it, and uh, he, he rested the, 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 the this pinwheel on on the on the tack on center, and so it so it was, it was the pinwheel was balancing on it, and 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 he. Uh, from three feet, about three feet away, he, he, he put he, he put out his hand, and and, uh, and uh, just he just looked at the at the pinwheel for uh, he, um, for just a little, just for just a few seconds, and then surely enough, uh, the, the the pinwheel was actually spinning, and it was it was actually gaining gaining speed. <laughs> It's it like a so an analogy can be like a, a a tire from a race car. <laughs> Dave, did you hear that? Dave, are you there? Oh, um, he's listening. I know he's listening, but um, yeah, Dave, are you there? Okay. Well, shortly here, I got to wrap up. I got only got about three minutes left. So, if right. uh, if you want to, uh, we're going to continue on uh, with that discussion. That was that was just incredible. That was mind blowing, man. I loved that. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. Um, it started out like a small thing and then turned into uh, like just racing like a car tire, eh? Wow. Oh yeah. Yeah, and and. Uh, it was it was incredible, and that's probably yeah, just yeah. he probably is just showing you a little taste of what he could actually do. I'll bet you. Oh yeah, more likely. <laughs> See, there's a lot of people that can do things that they don't want to tell anyone because, you know, uh, it, you know, I don't mind telling people certain things because I can't do it all the time. I do it. I did that a few times, and that's it. But still. You never know. They want to dissect me and stuff and rip me apart and see how I did that, and, you know, scientifically. Uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. I think that's what most yeah. people are scared of, that the dissection yeah. part. Yeah, it can be kind of a frightening motivator, yeah. Yeah. And, and uh, actually, this gives me an idea for, for, for the, the show that we, that we can do tomorrow. All right. Okay, well, thanks a lot for coming on, and you'll be back tomorrow. So, um, yep. if anybody wants to talk to Adam Watt about the real life X Men, well, it's not really what they are called. What they, they're the uh, Scion Scion Nation, I believe, and uh, yeah, they're the, the, the they're called uh, Scions. The uh, the website is Scion Nation. <laughs> oh wow! Okay, that's great. Okay, well, this is the Monster Castle Paranormal Radio signing off. Uh, thanks, everybody, for listening. I know a lot of you guys, it's too early for you, and you'll probably listen later. But um, I think you like this show, and I hope you did. I loved it, and uh, we're coming back for more tomorrow. I think it's going to get even spookier. 
Alright. Yes, it is. Yeah. <laughs> myself in the background with a little echo but that's cool all right can you dig it this is wolfman mike it is 420 it's time to burn some weed man that's what we do now that is what we do so i'm not sure what the fuck this is listen to this while you're ready to eat. Ah, my mind, you're taking away my last chance
I'm yeah. not sure if everyone else is talking. Oh, I think Mike just started a show too. Oh shit! Really? <laughs> Wolfman, no, are you? No, I, 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 no, I didn't do that. Yes, I did. Uh oh. Oh, you already started the show. Uh, casting. What, yeah. Mister Midnight Movies here? I am here. Oh, brother. Oh, how yeah. are you doing? Yeah. How are you, bro? Is, uh, yeah, the title of our show is Lady Forgiveness on New Year's. Um, no, uh, and, my lady uh, just left. She took off in a car, really mad at me. Oh, really? I'm calling my show Bitch. You know what? That's been an understatement. Tomorrow. Uh, are you, okay? you going to be okay? No. Probably not. I don't know what's going to happen now. Probably cops or something. No, oh, my God. So, um, no hide in the corn or something. Now, but it's raining out, ha- too. Yeah, by the way, we've uh, we've been having a long uh, discussion and, and argument about um, squirting. Liz seems to think that it's urine, which means she's never squirted before. I don't think it's urine assignment says it's urine, Mr. Midnight Movie. Get over it. <laughs> so you're saying the woman that squirted in my face. I don't need to say anything. Medically, it's fucking piss, Mr. Midnight Movie. So where I peed on you. Where do you admit you've never squirted? Yeah. I didn't do nothing to you. I pee every I single not do day, you guys. I am talking to... Listen, I'm talking... I am talking... Are you going to better at with you? Talk to my friends, girl. Make her squirt. Finish with your fucking bullshit. Make her squirt. I pee every single day, so you're good. I'm I'm good over here. Have you ever had a squirt orgasm during lovemaking? Have I ever pissed on someone during sex? No. What? Man, you've obviously never done it, so you know. It's pee. Mr. Midnight Movie? No. Liz, how come you've never achieved squirting? How come you've never, yeah, you've never... What is the blockage there? Why aren't you letting yourself go? You're probably a little uptight. Why am I not unleashing my bladder on people during sex? You know, because I do giggle exercises, maybe? Look, look, there's so many videos on squirting, and... Sure, there is. I've been squirting myself, not me, but I've been with a woman who squirted. It was not pee. Uh, this is unbelievable. Did it taste, like, did it taste like pee? It, not it taste tasted like, like love. And love does not taste like pee. It was the taste <laughs> of pee, Dan. Yeah, I think it piss lovers. Piss lovers. What okay, female ejaculation? How could you downplay female ejaculation, Liz? I can, I don't have to convince you that it's urine. Science tells us that it's urine, fellow. I don't, I don't know, I don't know how else to explain it to you. Wait a minute, I have, wait, I have, uh, what is squirting? Okay, it's oh. not, okay, wait a minute, it's not pee. Contrary. To what you may have heard, the fluid that women release when they ejaculate is not urine. Yes, it is. It is Even mostly urine. Ejaculate. I have friends that are doctors. We talk about urine. Come around, Liz. Now, it's, it's, urine. Urine. It's, all, it's mostly urine. You're totally wrong. Uh, my I think it's both. Some girls just... There is, there is, there is some, like, fluid that gets mixed up in there. It's, it's not 100% urine, but it's mostly urine. If it comes from the ure- urethra, it's urine. If it comes from the... The skin's right. Yeah, they did... They What's had the a test where they had like, they were watching like a woman's bladder during the whole process, and some you know people that claim to squirt and bladder was full before, and it emptied after squirting. Now, unless there's some magic thing going on, um, that's, that's urine. It's pee mixed with love. 
Yeah, that's okay. P mixed with love. Sure, Mr. Midnight Movie. That's what it is. So, because they say, uh, but it does, okay. It is released through the urethra, the same hole you pee out of, says now. No. But it doesn't smell or look like urine at all. Yeah, that's because it's like fresh fucking pee. Squirting is the It third. hasn't been like hanging out in your bladder for very long. Not to mention, if you're hydrated and you go to the bathroom, like say you drink lots of water and you go to the bathroom, it doesn't smell like you're, you probably have like diabetes <laughs> urine that has, yeah. gives off funky smells and shit. Most people that are hydrated, like I, you know, there's not really, I don't smell a lot when I go to the bathroom. Liz, if the science says women experience involuntary emissions of fluid ranging from 30 to 150 milliliters, this is become you know, colloquially as squirting. <laughs> yeah. You're talking to a Jewish person, he knows the scientific shit. Yeah, they, they did it a whole thing. They were, the watching, they, were watching the, they were watching females. They were watching their whole system during sex, watching the whole fucking thing, and they saw exactly what happened during squirting. And I hate to disappoint you again, you're being peed on. Most of it. Now, you get other fluids in there, too. No, you know, I'm putting the, you. The, everyone the, gets- it's the vaginal area. It is the vaginal area. There's other things that get mixed in there, too, but it's mostly urine. I like the vaginal area. I like mine. That's not it. Simply not true. Yeah. Simply okay. not true. Uh, yeah. Fucking magic. Four. A psychologist named Magic, Ellen. like yes. Magic Ellen. Squirting. Okay. So we should, we should make- was analogous to semen and originated from the Bartholin Bartol- glands. Two pea-sized glands. We're going to impregnate a woman with it. Two pea-sized yeah. glands There's two are glands. responsible okay. for squirting. Okay. Nobody rules my life. Nobody Fuck tells that. me what to do, man. Fuck that shit. That's right. Liz is frigid. Yeah. You don't give a fuck about the anime you never had. You're scared about your coffee. Bring that lady on and ask if Brian needs to talk. Wah, 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 wah. Everybody yeah. hears you now. Fine, you're an asshole. Of course you're still bland. If she a squirter, <laughs> oh, she'd man. be a scary squirter. He sounds angry. He's angry. He's an angry squirter. She sounds like when she makes love, it's like, Yeah, see, I bet when she squirts, it's... I I can't even talk to you guys, man. She's, like, yelling at me so bad, I couldn't even put my microphone on. Fuck. Put her on. Can can she come on the show? No, she's not going to, because she don't even understand what the fucking hell is going on here. Yeah. What would she say if, if you asked her, like, on a calm moment about squirting? You know, it's squirting. only 1230 at night here in Ontario. Um, it's not that late. And I'm the one motherfucker that has to go to work tomorrow, not her. Oh, she don't even have to drive me. or nothing. She gets fucking sleep in. I got to get up in the morning. So, And why is she fucking mad at me? I don't understand that one. Is she a squirter? Fuck her. Fuck everyone. Fuck this. I'm going to kill myself. There you what go. Work are you going to do at eight in the morning, anyways? What the fuck, man? Work. But yeah, what kind of work? Well, I got to work tomorrow. <laughs> I have to make <laughs> money, man. You know, Wolfman, you better settle down, sir. Uh, that is totally unacceptable. You uh, must be uh, feeling kind of uh, upset this evening. Uh, maybe you should. Uh, talk to Dr. Phil. Oh, God, I ain't talking to anyone. Um, you really have a problem there. Uh, this is Dr. Phil. Would you like to be on my show? Well, come on. All of Scissors, which I think uh, is a real I can person. Probably is help you. This is Dr. Bill. Liz I like to walk to around do naked. Tomorrow. She's here. Yeah. Uh, all of Scissors. 
Jesus. All righty then. Might work, but you don't squirt. Squirt!
sick. I'm a nut. I'm a nut. My life don't ever get in a rut. The head on my shoulders is sort of loose, and I ain't got sense. God gave a goose. Lord, I ain't crazy. But I'm a nut. Is it wetter underwater if you're there when it rains? Is it shorter to New York than it is by plane? Between myself and I, I wonder who's the dumber. Is it hotter down south? Than it is in the summer. I'm a nut. I'm a nut. My life don't ever get in a rut. The head on my shoulders is sort of loose, and I ain't got sense. God gave a goose, Lord, I ain't crazy. But I'm a nut. I drove my Cadillac to Vegas to satisfy my lust. Well, and deal little left old Vegas on a Greyhound bus. You didn't set the woods on fire while I was there But remember only forest fires prevent bears I'm a nut, I'm a nut, my life don't ever get in a rut. The head on my shoulders is sort of loose, and I ain't got sense God gave a goose, Lord, I ain't crazy, but I'm a nut. The poverty war will be over when I begin to fight. If it took a time to go around the world, I couldn't get out of sight. I don't mind to take the girls out if they don't mind to go Dutch. Makes me feel like a million dollars, and I bet I ain't worth half that much. I'm a nut, I'm a nut, my life don't ever get in a rut. The head on my shoulders is sort of loose, and I ain't got sense, God gave a goose, Lord, I ain't crazy, but I'm a nut. Crazy, all right, craziness, dig it, I dig crazy, crazy is cool, all right, welcome to Dirty Rotten Taro, ladies and gentlemen. And we've got a new star of the show. Oh, we have. I dig it. Hi. Here he is. (laughs) And it's Camden, the four and a half year old psychic kid. I'm the I'm the owner in the whole world in my world. I own my town. I own Florida. That's why I own because I built the house. I built in my house, my own house. So we have we have the owner of Florida <laughs> here on our show tonight. Oh really? He's four four years old and he owns Florida. Can, no, he's four and a half. You yeah. need to step back now. Eric's in charge. <laughs> Camden, can you tell us a little about yourself? Do you have psychic? Oh, um, hey, 